Hey guys, welcome to episode 11 of my Pokemon Yellow LP. The goal of this episode is to make it to the entrance of Rock Tunnel using this party that I have here. Um, I'm using Clefairy simply because I needed someone to teach Flash to and it looked like Clefairy was like my only Pokemon I had in the box besides Pikachu who could learn Flash and I didn't want to give Flash to Pikachu. I have Ivysaur just because of the type I figured it would be an advantage inside Rock Tunnel. Ninorino's double kick would be um, a good advantage inside Rock Tunnel. I'm keeping Pikachu solely because it's my starter, and I don't even believe you can box Pikachu. I'm not sure though. Gloom, because I need cut in order to access Rock Tunnel. And Squirtle for the type advantage, and Squirtle needs training because he's gonna be uh, one of my main party members. So that's my explanation of my party and my levels. I'm a little nervous because their levels aren't spectacular. For all of them, but I'm gonna see if I can make it to Rock Tunnel without fainting here. So in order to get to Rock Tunnel, we have to take the Vermilion Cerulean Tunnel back to Cerulean. That's kind of a mouthful. And then we're gonna take the path that we did not take before in order to get to Rock Tunnel. So we're back in familiar territory here. Passing by the daycare on our left that I will never ever use because they charge you money for it. <laughs> okay, well, we're not going to be here for long. Enjoy the music for now. <laughs> okay, and we're here. New route. We're going to use Gloom to cut this. And we are officially on route number... If I can check... Nine. All right, so this chick right here, we're gonna use Ivysaur, I guess. Not sure what she has. You have Pokemon with you. You're mine. Oh, okay. <laughs> kind of weird thing to say. Bendy Legs wants to fight. And she sent out Oddish. Okay, not really the best matchup. We'll use Tackle. Oh, are you kidding me? Absorb is not really gonna do very much. Yeah, one. Nice job. Okay. He's gonna keep absorbing, I guess, and I'll just keep tackling. Bell Sprout. Okay, we're switching. Let's go to. Nidorino. I don't have very many good choices for these grass types. Makes me wonder if I should have brought Charmeleon along. Alright, that was no problem. Oddish. We're gonna stick with Nidorino. Okay, that only hurt me too. I don't believe I have any paralyzed heals, so that's really annoying. And another Bell Sprout. We're gonna stick with Nidorino. Nidorino's getting a lot of the action here. Okay, we defeated Junior Trainer. You deceived me! You need light to get through that dark tunnel ahead. Actually, when I was like eight years old, I didn't know you could use flash or whatever, and I went through the whole rock tunnel without flash. It was just a bunch of trial and error, <laughs> but I actually did it when I was like eight years old. I also didn't realize that you could catch new Pokemon until I beat Misty um, on my first try through Pokemon Blue version. Oh goodness. Okay, so I'm trying to by bypass all these trainers, just looking around here. Okay, I can totally skip that hiker that's chilling right there. Alright, there's a trainer right here. A bug catcher, I think. So, we're gonna switch. Because, um... Ivysaur's paralyzed. Okay, we have to encounter him. Go, my super bug Pokemon! <laughs> These guys! Seriously, how late in the game do they keep appearing? Caterpie. A level 20 Caterpie. 
It's ridiculous. Let's shock it to death. Alright. Weedle. Can I catch a Weedle in um, Pokemon Yellow? Does anyone know? Because I was looking for a Weedle uh, a few episodes ago and I couldn't find one. So if you know if I can find a Weedle in Pokemon Yellow, let me know. A Venonat. Yeah, let's try Nidorino. I mean, I caught my own Venonat and I caught my own Caterpie, but I cannot find a Weedle to save my life. Alright, we took out Venonat. My bugs! I'm so sorry. If you don't like bug Pokemon, you bug me. <laughs> well, you bug trainers bug me. Like, to no end. Uh, there's a little patch of grass right there. I'm not sure what wild Pokemon appear there. There's a hiker right here. I'm gonna avoid him. And we got a trainer who's probably gonna see me. Uh, I'll stick with Pikachu. I guess. Oh, okay, she didn't see me. Wonderful. Alright, we're in the next area here. If you go around here, and if I had Surf, it's too early in the game yet, but if you had Surf, you can Surf down there to get to the electric plant, power plant. Um, there's stuff to do down there. Ah, uh, wild stuff. Let's just speed through this. Alright, and that brings us to the entrance of Rock Tunnel. Let's just see what else is over here. Um, we've got lots of different bushes to cut. And there's a trainer right there. Can I avoid her? Yeah, you can avoid her. Rock Tunnel. Alright, a rather short episode, but this is the party I'm going to be entering Rock Tunnel with, even though it looks kind of weird. That's what I'm going to try to enter, enter Rock Tunnel with. Um, I'm going to go back and fight the other trainers off camera, just to level up a little bit. Besides that, that's what we're going to be doing next episode. So until next time, thanks for watching. Okay, just kidding. That's not the end of the episode just yet. Um, I felt that what I'm about to show you doesn't really uh, constitute its own episode or even like the first part of the next episode I was going to do. And because episode 11 was so short to begin with, I, w I just want to show you this really fast. I thought it was like amazing. So I was training off camera after, you know, the original episode 11. And I fought this guy right here, and he has a sand shrew. And this is what he said when you're done fighting him. I'll restart my 100 win streak with sand shrew. If you remember the anime, like, there was this guy Ash fought, and he had a sand shrew, and he was trying to get to 100 wins or something. And, uh, oh, okay, okay, whatever, whatever. Maybe I'm just being incredibly dorky, but I thought that was the coolest little Easter egg. So if you didn't know that, that guy's in this game, and he's chilling out right here with a level 24 sand shrew. So, <laughs> if you remember that episode, you could like share my dork moment, hopefully. Um, yeah, and that's all I wanted to really share. So, now is the real end of episode 11. <laughs> okay, I'll see you next time.